Howdy everyone, it's me, Manic Mark, coming to you from the Bunker System, located underneath the Arvilla Pound, somewhere in the jungles of the Midwest, and it's record day today. Remember... Whoops, I'm getting closer to smashing it. Okay, um, Mother Nature's giving us one more hot day, as you can tell. I just got done carrying in groceries and everything. And I don't give myself a moment to cool down. I just go right to the video camera. Um, what happened today? Something happened. A little thing happened. Oh, okay. I'm in Sam's, and I, I used to get Bud Light Lime. I'm going to go back to that, but right now I'm, like, fixated on this this Mexican beer that comes in a 24-pack that's got a variety of beer in it. They all taste good. I like it, and so I buy it. But I'm like, So I'm looking at it today, and right next to it is, like, a 24-pack of Coronas for the same price, and I'm like, hmm, well, Corona sounds good, but why is it the same price as this beer? It's usually pretty expensive. There's something odd-shaped about that box. What's, what's wrong here? 10-ounce bottles, 24 10-ounce bottles, not 12-ounce bottles. Now, mind you, when I get down to the last two ounces of beer in a 12-ounce bottle, I'm fantasizing that this the 12-ounce bottle would have 16 ounces, like there should be another four ounces in a 12-ounce bottle. So 10 ounces just ain't going to do it. So I left it behind and got the real 12-ounce bottles. Okay, let's go right to the records. Song of the Islands, Danny Stewart. That's a wonderful cover, don't you think? Very countrified, featuring Blake Bynum and Roy Harper. Anyway, Sister Felix. I'm like, who's Sister Felix? A pop singer from the 60s? No, she's like the... Like the nun from the 60s. She's singing stuff. Nun singing. Laugh, my friends. Um, another M Meryl Womack album that I must have missed last week. Meryl, the disfigured evangelist gospel singer, does Christmas carols. That'll be Peach King, don't you think? I think so. Emma at the Royale. <laughs> don't you love that cover? Truck Driver's Queen. I've got this one. What what are the chances that I would run across another copy of this at Half Price Books? I have no idea. Gold. Don't know who Jack Gold is. Not the Jack Gold. I used to know Jack Gold, but this is not him. Why did I pick this up? Because uh, I never heard of him. And there's a, co a cover of Aquarius, which is always a good bet that there'll be something good. But there he is on the cover. He's the little singing midget kind of guy. I said midget at lunch when I showed the gang that record, and they said, you have to say little persons now. And I'm, so I'm going to say, here's a little person of midget stature, right here. Uh, okay, and a Liberty, my favorite label, uh, the invitations, RSVP. Uh, it's a Hawaiian group. Look at that. I wonder if they do a Hawaiian, kind of like uh, the four freshmen. Anyway, it's another chance for Liberty to come through. Uh, this was kind of curious, the longest day. It's on budget, diplomat. So I picked it up. Went on too long there. Here's another label, Indigo Records. Never heard of that label. Um, out of California. Budget. Hawaiian album. A live album. They're in a room someplace with a drop ceiling. Bill Green's Golden Dragon. Tink, listen up if you're watching. Uh, Manila Polynesian Room in Asbury Park, New Jersey. <laughs> Uh, Jan August, cha-cha-cha charm, Jan August, Jay Dodds, the new poet of the organ, ebb tide. And last but not least, here's a sealed private press, sealed private press called On With The Show, Gary Edmonds and Sage, his backup band is Sage, play the Tiki Drummers, you have to cut all that out, that was way too much yapping, thanks everybody for stopping by. Whoops, that was close. <laughs>